Hey friends, welcome to the YouTube channel all about electronics. So in this question, we have been given the current to voltage converter and we have been asked to find the magnitude of the transfer impedance of the given circuit. So here we have been given that the given op is the ideal op -amp. and here because of the negative feedback, we can apply the concept of the virtual ground. That means here, since the non-inverting terminal of the op is at the ground potential, so we can say that this V minus is also equal to zero. That means this node is also at the ground potential. So here, let's assume that this node is equal to X and the voltage at this node is equal to Vx. So here, since the op is the ideal op so no current is flowing into the op terminal. That means this current I will flow in this direction. So we can say that this current I is equal to zero minus Vx divided by 45 kilo ohm or that is equal to minus Vx divided by 45 kilo ohm. So now let us apply the KCL at this node. So applying the KCL we can write this Vx minus V out divided by 55.5 kilo ohm plus Vx minus 0 divided by 5 kilo ohm and that is equal to I. So here we have assumed that these two are the outgoing currents while this current I is the incoming current. So further if we simplify it then we can write it as this Vx minus V out plus 11.1 .1 times Vx and that is equal to 55.5 kilo ohm times I. So we can say that this 12.1 times Vx minus 55.5 kilo ohm times I that is equal to V out. So here to find the transfer impedance basically we need to find the ratio of the V out and the I. So here let us represent this voltage Vx in terms of the current I. So from this expression we can say that this voltage Vx is equal to minus 45 kilo ohm times I and let us put this value of Vx in the given expression. So by putting that value, we can write this expression as 12.1 times minus 45 kilo ohm times I minus 55.5 kilo ohm times I. That means V out is equal to minus 600 kilo ohm times I. So from this we can say that this V out divided by I is equal to minus 600 kilo ohm. And here, this negative sign indicates that for the given current direction, the value of the output voltage will be negative. But here, we have been just asked to find the magnitude of this transfer impedance. So if we just consider the magnitude, then that is equal to 600 kilo ohm. So from this we can say that the magnitude of the transfer impedance for this given current to voltage converter is equal to 600 kilo ohm. And in the mega ohm, that is equal to 0.6 mega ohm. That means for the given question, the answer is equal to 0.6 mega ohm.